my first gasifier in Sri Lanka. Look at this. Sergey, well, like I said, it caught fire again. So here it is already smoldering. I won't wait for the torch to ignite. There's our wonderful torch through the stove. Because otherwise, as you said, I will overheat the engine. I'll show you now. The engine is at 38. In the shell, it's 120. Uh, through the pipe, it's da, booming da. Uh, 100. And at the output, we have, well, already 300. Meaning it caught on quickly. I won't keep heating it further so that the torch really ignites. But essentially, the torch is already burning. Yes, the torch is starting to burn. We won't decrease the revolutions now. Sir, a deep bow to you. Uh, we'll be modifying this uh, further. I'll explain everything, share all ideas. Uh, well, probably the day after tomorrow when I get to uh, Belarus. Uh, thank you very much. A deep bow and have a good evening. It's a pleasure to deal with you, Sergei. Thank you. What are the nuances? The thing is, they used to heat with wet wood chips before, which caused insane overconsumption. But rice husk is practically free fuel. These wet wood chips can have moisture levels up to 71%. And at such moisture levels, the overconsumption is simply double or triple. And rice husk is basically waste. It's an environmental disaster there. There's a lot of it, and it costs nothing. And the most important thing is the carbon left after the rice husk. About 20%, like charcoal we have. And you can also make activated carbon from it. And we're discussing this topic now. This is already the second rice husk gasifier that I built. The first one, I was teaching an Indian. They needed 400 kilowatts there. They designed it incorrectly. I had to retrain them. It's a very interesting experience. For you guys who want to delve into this business and design coal, lime burning. There, you can earn millions of dollars from this. I invite you to the Telegram group, Gazifrabot. Here is the address where I gathered all the knowledge base available on gasifiers. You can come. There are many enthusiasts followers, and those who have assembled both small and large ones for industry, numbers, business, everything is there. The only place where you can find all the knowledge in a concentrated form. Come join us.